friends this is my second tutorial of uh, uh, binding navigator uh, today we are going to discuss a manually create a next previous first and last button also we can uh, uh, insert and update and delete data from database okay fine so as you can see on a previous uh, my tutorial uh, we have already created a database and uh, already have a table table data so now open a visual studio for a header file and create a object of connection data database and command first create a binding source bss create object and create a connection public white connection uh, create a method that we can use on this page public name anyway so create a connection on a page we'll call a connection and first uh, create a sql command by using a data table uh, pass sql query and connection and fill a uh, data adapter first bind a grid this is a grid grid bind a grid and uh, also bind a bss binding source from data table all data tables data uh, now contain uh, bss binding source so there is a text field username password and here we can see all data we pass a uh, data to text boxes user text username password and there is a table field name username password and this is a id uh, uh, on the last uh, we can use this this is a hide id because when we can uh, delete and update data mm, so first properties of this button okay drag and drop uh, button from uh, build box double click on first so there is a binding source so which is also always binded to binding navigator uh, sorry binding source Private function which will declare in this class and show selected. Okay, so this is for using clear uh, previous data and uh, this is a grid view row CSS select three. Okay, so position we have discussed last level. There just use a BSS move next and previous uh, BSS move previous BSS move first BSS move last. So these function we will discuss. Okay, now doctor. Now we see. This is a next. A row selected row selected function okay this is this is a bss row bss position this is a select of position of cursor where uh, our data is pointed so this function is used for 
selecting a row you can see here we have select selected if we are not using this This function is used for selecting a, a row to to detect it. We are going to discuss a position. This position is of binder. So binding sort dot position plus one because index is start from zero. So there is use the plus one. This is a total row count on a table. Position call of position and call it goes by it goes random is next and uh, this is call this is change of position of position so this is using we can use a label. Here I use a label. Okay. Uh, I print a position of uh, row. So now we can, if we want to save or insert a data, new data from database, update and also view. So we get a three button: save, update, and view. Doesn't go from uh, controls. Click on save and there is class SQL query inserting to login username password uh, your parameter and text username password so pass a query to cmd command and connection and cmd dot execute non query after all god have a greater than zero then we go from it Calls it also we show update and update login text username equal to this password equal to this here id this is the id this is the hide id which uh, we pass also on one label okay this is a lpl data mining process so when we move uh, data this is also changed so update execute non query also this delete and delete okay so delete from there hide id is equal to this and cmd dot execute non query the record have greater than zero then we have the message so data I'm sorry but we have to insert the data from the database username test star password same star so that call save so if we want to this And if we want to update this last no, 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 we want to update this now username password this password is used for update this call update right. so we have to go 
it's okay. Now we're going to delete a basic code. Damn it. 